my dad's been sleeping with his sister for over a year. I briefly brought this up in another post, but this is worth a post of its own. So backstory. My mom's been cheating on my dad with a guy she met online for three years. He ended up moving to our home state to be closer to her. My dad's not really the best man. He's got narcissistic behaviors and nothing has ever been good enough for him. We live on a farm so his whole life is farm and my mom was pushed aside. So I wasn't upset when she found another man. Boyfriend is good to her. I tried pushing her to divorce dad years ago but that's never worked out. About a year and a half ago my dad found out he has a long lost sister. Same dad different mom. They did the DNA test and found out they are related. My aunt would drive two hours at least once a week to see my dad while she had her own family at home. They would do things that raised some eyebrows. Like she wrote him a long birthday letter that read kind of like a love letter. They would always be super close physically and he would always make sure to call her at least once a day. About a year ago mom's boyfriend moved back home to his home state. Around that time too my uncle, mom's brother, started dating mom's boyfriend's daughter. My uncle moved down to the home state to live with her on my mom's boyfriend's family property. About two months ago my mom went to go visit her man and my uncle with my brother and sister. She had a camera set up in the living room and watched my dad and his sister cuddle. She showed my sister and next thing you know aunt and dad start boning on the couch. My sister brother, and mom were all watching it live. My dad denied everything. A week ago a farmhand told mom that he walked in on dad and sister boning in the barn a year ago. People at our local gas station thought aunt was dad's wife with how close they were. So my dad finally just told my mom that they have had an ongoing relationship for the last year. My mom is planning on divorcing and probably moving out of state. This is all just new family drama. Don't get me started on my stepbrother writing love letters to my mom. Or my child loving real dad. Or how my aunt, mom's sister, is a lot lizard and her husband doesn't know about that. Or my other uncle, mom's brother, is in a cult. Or how my grandma, mom's mom, is convinced I'm running a sex cult while smoking crack. Or how my other grandma, real dad's mom, was a black magic witch and would kill cats. It's f up my dad sleeping with his sister isn't a surprise. I feel like I need a TV show. I'd probably be in the third season. Edit. My dad's mom had schizophrenia. She believed she was reincarnated from a witch from the Salem witch trials. She was crazy. Loved blood. Spent a good chunk of her life institutionalized. Edit too. Y'all I'm from Michigan I've moved away and started my own life away from my family with my boyfriend. Who I'm not related to. Sorry for the mush of words too. I typed it all at work in the bathroom. Whoops. Definitely need a therapist. But the Prozac is definitely helping. Would you guys believe no one in my family drinks or does drugs? They are just naturally like that. So happy I left. Story 2. My girlfriend of four years cheated with my friend. This happened a few months ago, my, 21M, girlfriend, 21F, cheated in our apartment while I was asleep in our bedroom. It started when summer was just beginning and we wanted friends over to our apartment to hang out and have some drinks and bonfires and just have fun. By chance. I was picking up food for the both of us when all of my childhood best friends, about six guys, showed up together where I was picking up the food. I was excited to see them all and it was a Friday night and I invited all of them back to our apartment to have a bonfire and hang out. They all accepted and that night was one of the best nights I had had in a long while. This began to be an event we had every weekend and we were all loving it. My girlfriend has always been too touchy when she has been drinking but she had always assured me she would never ever cheat and that she despised cheaters, so I wasn't too concerned when she was talking to my friends and getting a little close, because I had absolute trust in her. One of my friends had recently gotten out of a long relationship and he was a lonely person, 
they had some things in common and that would keep them talking through most of the night. One thing they bonded over was they had both lost an uncle that they had cared about, she called it trauma bonding. Fast forward a few weeks and we're still having the get-togethers, we partied until about 6am and I decided to smoke some weed with a few friends, and that ended up putting me right to bed, I passed out on our couch and I woke up in our bedroom around noon pretty hungover. I got up because my girlfriend wasn't with me in bed and I walked out to the living room and it was just the two of them. They were both fully clothed and listening to music, I sat down next to her for a minute before I suggest that we get to bed. As soon as we laid down she started crying softly, and she said I love you, instantly I knew something had happened. She told me they got really drunk and he kissed her, but it was nothing more than that. I was angry and I wanted so badly to do something but she begged me to not be mad at him or to hurt him, so I obliged. I bottled my anger and I drove him home. I felt off all day, and I had asked her multiple times if anything else had happened and she assured me every time that nothing else did. The next night I was working a graveyard shift and my girlfriend went out to the bar with the same people, I felt insecure leaving her around him so I left work to go to that bar. She flipped on me, calling me a bitch and telling me that I didn't trust her and that I only left work to babysit her. One of my friends told me that he saw her phone, and that she messaged her sister admitting that she actually did cheat. I left the bar in anger but eventually, I got her to go back to our apartment where I gave her an ultimatum, either you tell me the truth right now or I leave. I never thought for a second that she had actually had sex with him because I had absolute trust in her. When presented with the ultimatum she said if I tell you then you'll leave me and right at that second I knew. I packed some suitcases and drove to my mom's where I broke down. I tried to message the friend that did this and all I asked him was why. He then blocked me on everything. Still currently staying at my mom's but I'm not quite sure where to go from here. TLDR, old friends and I were partying when my girlfriend got attached to one of them and hooked up with him after everyone left and I passed out drunk in our bedroom then proceeded to lie about it. Thank you for listening to today's story, please comment below on your opinion of today's story. If there is a story you would like to share with me please email the story to me. If you are not subscribed please take the time to subscribe and like, and I will see you in the following story, take care.